got this call today for the produce case that has this fruits in it and you can see one of the fans stopped working we've got a plug drain and it looks like the bottom half or the bottom third eh, more like the bottom half is a flat sheet or layer of ice submerging the lower third or lower half of the evaporator you see it also kind of in there This unit is 25 years old. Okay, so that was me in the motor room just now initiating a manual defrost on system 1F. 1F. So, man, this is some old shit. I'm gonna have to see, um, what the hell. This is a weird looking fan blade. I don't think I've ever seen a blade shaped like this, shaped like an inverted umbrella. Looks to me like, like how can this thing even move here? that the blades like what direction is like that ain't gonna move any air like who it, how does this happen you guys does this happen from years to 25 years of moving air and having the the resistance of the moving air acting against these were these originally shaped better than this because this is Chingy. They're not moving in the air. You know, I was wondering why I couldn't feel any air coming out of here. Even if this was going, this thing wouldn't be moving in the air. So I got these blades in my truck, they're just some spares until uh, until I can get some, some new ones for them.
Now I can feel some air moving, that's how it's supposed to be. So it turns out I had those extra two blades and then I took my third on uh, this. I just took the um, the outer frame. I took that off of it and it fits in here good after I put these three little brackets on. So I'm actually gonna go to United and see if I can get some new blades or maybe another one of these MD55472 motors and come back and uh, and that's gonna be it but this thing's already looking really good
keep it. And it fits in here good after I put these three little brackets on. So I'm actually gonna go to United and see if I can get some new blades. So this video ended up ending on me pretty quick. I went to United Refrigeration and then I got two motors because I took one off my truck and returned, I installed it and I got so caught up that I just kind of forgot to record something for the end. Sorry about that. So I just put all these little clips together for you and just wanted to say thanks for watching. I hope you found it interesting. Let me know what you think about those weird looking fan blades because I've never seen fan blades do something like that. They were weird. So, catch you next time. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Be a great thing to do if you like this stuff especially. And see you next time.